Okay. I think that works. Okay. Should be working. Yes. Okay. I have seen these videos get way too many views. And now this is basically my time. <laughs> to make a good tutorial, because I'm not going to lie. I've seen way too many people say you need to go in the mines to practice this and go up like those dumb crystals. Which I will go show you a spot right now to do that mines. Uh, which I'll be teaching Lucia running, vertically, and maybe some spider climbing. But, what the? But I'm not 100% sure of it. Okay, yes, because he's horrible at the game. <laughs> anyway, uh, this is like a pretty good wall for like... The, if you were doing the mines, which I already don't really suggest too much. This is better for like learning wall running rather than loose running and... Verticaling, uh, there's just a, one place, I'd say, in mines to do it. Caves, I mean. So, loose running, uh, you could just do kind of like a slanted funny run, I guess. Practice it like this. To do that and just try going across these walls without falling off get to here at least if we do that pretty consistently then you got like the basics of loose showing down and that's just in count mines before we go back to loose running we have verticaling this is a somewhat decent spot it is a little difficult because it is very straight up which most vertical spots in forest, not gonna be all the way straight up. <laughs> but anyway, before I continue, 60 here, it's very recommended. 72, also pretty good. 90, anything matters besides 120. Just don't be on 120 hertz. That is the worst thing you could do <laughs> in Gorilla Tag if you wanna get good. Anyway, this is a decent vertical spot. You jump up to like right here. Bro, I'm lagging. <laughs> I swear to God, bro. Anyway, you don't. I'm in the cave still. I'm still. I kind of like in the middle. That's where I am. Uh, for beginners, you could practice here. Uh, blue crystal, huge. The way, right, dead smack in the middle. The guy. Where are you, brother? I don't see you. I'm stuck. Oh, there you are. Anyway, this is a decent place to like get started, just cause it's a little more slanted. <laughs> could try. You could even try loose showing up this if you want i'm pretty good at it i'm playing 60 hertz right now so it's probably the easiest but loosening up this is somewhat difficult anyway verticaling in the mines uh caves i mean not super suggested but you know it is still definitely a possibility i'm not actually good at the game unlike most people that make tutorials on these um i have probably a upcoming a thousand hours on this game don't want to talk about it but i <laughs> i play this game too much um right you want us to do it right right here kind of and you want to try to get get to this crystal this pink crystal once you make it there consistently you want to try to make it to this that slanted part of the top anyway let's get out of here what the heck was that let's get out of here and talk about practicing in the forest because that is in my opinion what helped me learn the most kind of first of all common mistake don't practice loose running on this wall obviously it will come kind of naturally once you're good at it you can loose your up this wall pretty easily same with verticaling especially on this wall oh shoot that sucked you didn't see that. you didn't see that but like uh once you're good enough this this is probably one of the easiest Oh, bro, I can't play the game anymore. What the heck? This is one of the easier spots to vertical high up. Uh, if you're new, so you just uh, branch up. If you're getting better and you're like an intermediate vertical, go grass to the top. There are better spots to vertical, which I will show you in a minute. They are definitely a lot harder, but anyway, where I learned Alicia, just right over here on this wall. Oh shoot, battery low, who cares? Uh, well, first common mistake, people jump like right here and start their Lucio, which isn't like horrible, 
But like if you're advanced, you know basically not to start there. There's a slight slant. You can see if I stand right here, there's like a little indent on this wall. Kind of like right here by that black dot. You want to jump to the black dot before you start your Lucio. And uh, I'll show you a basic motion, I guess. This is Lucio's motion. He does kind of a weird chop wood method, I guess you want to call it. He goes kind of like this. He moves his hands up and down the way he does it. And he can go flying off the wall. Uh, I don't like that method. I think it's a little complicated and dumb. Uh, the basic method, I would go like this. Very basic method. What you want to do to start off, you want to go like slow. Just to get decent at it. Maybe try to consistently make it to this branch. Once you can make it to that branch pretty consistently, start like slowly speeding up. To, to the point where you do it enough and your ratios will look smooth, kind of like this. Where it looks like you're never coming off the wall. But you definitely... I mean, you're not, because, you know, you're still touching the wall, but... Once your Lucio looks really smooth and it looks like you're not ever missing a hit, that's perfect. It's exactly what you want. Yeah, once you're better at the at Lucio running, kind of go for a method like this. Flick your wrist up and down. Move your arms in circles at the same time. You do that, you can get really high. I can make it all the way to red slips. I'm not warmed up right now, really, but... I'll still try, I guess. Yeah, I'm doing really bad right now. I only made it slips. And it was really not clean, but... Anyway. Uh, verticling. Like the video checkpoint. Verticling, you want to start in the same spot. Uh, for beginners, especially. You want to start in the slant part. Try to get at least three hits on this part right here. So you want to build a... One, two, three... One, two, three. Make it like about to the top of this big black dot right here. Once you do that, switch. One, two, switch. One, two, switch. That should get you the slips. If you just do three on that first wall, two hits on every other wall. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Just two on every wall even gets you the slips. Now... Once you can make it to slips, with vertically, which I'm going to show you motion, in case you're still struggling, which a lot of people probably will be, uh, you can either go like this, you get your hand parallel, and you're just kind of circling around like this, and doing it very fast to get more speed. It does take a while. I, it took me two weeks to like reach slips, but I had a really bad motion, so it should take you guys a little less time. Maybe a day if you practice long enough. Yeah, it just takes practice, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but technically you did do it, you know? If you can get three hits on this wall, it's really good for starting. Yeah, see? That's definitely better um, than, you know, rumble wall running like this. You got like double the height. Anyway. Now, if you play 60 hertz especially, you can go like this. And you can just do this very, very quickly. Uh, maybe a little bit of flicker wrist as well. And then you can make it to slip way easier. Yeah, 120, like I said earlier in the video. A very bad idea <laughs> for walls. Branching, it's not, like, ideal either. You might want to use, like, 90 hertz. Like, uh, 60, not perfect for branching. But, like, you can see, okay, I messed up. But, like, it's still very possible with 60, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you gotta use side quests, though. You, the lowest you can get uh, without side quests is 90. I think default for index is like 80 hertz or 72, something like that. Anyway. Okay, your center point at 120 hertz. I'm gonna show you the specific motion that's better than for like 90 and 120. You kind of wanna... You wanna do circles kind of like this, right? Like half circles. Woo! Then once you hit the wall, I suggest, it's not necessary, but it helped me learn this a little bit quicker. You want to flick your wrist as you're, as you're touching the wall. So you want to go like, and then, you know, do circles with your wrist and a little bit of circling with your arm. And then you should make a lot of improvement that way. You could always try 
the movement I showed earlier, but I don't suggest it for beginners. Unless you're already on 60 hertz and you got that down. Anyway, another good wall for it is this one. Jump to this slant right here. I could do Lucio's. Oh, that sucked. Do backwards. I'm doing really bad right now because I you will lose a little bit of refresh rate, I guess, while recording. But other than that, I could do the same thing with your left hand. This is a pretty good wall with left hand verticaling. I'm not great with left hand verticals, I kinda suck with it. Left hand Lucio, if you wanna do this wall, you can. I would suggest starting like right here ish if you can get good at it. Otherwise you could start like right here. I'm somewhat decent at that. Once you can make it to slips or close to slips over there, then you could try to come over here, do the same method. But you gotta try to hit all the way up. You can start here if you want. It's like four hits, and you can make it up to here. Now, canyons. The infamous canyons. First, if you're good at verticaling, practice going like straight up the planks in forest, or straight up these walls in the city too. Making it up to there. It's pretty easy once you get good at it. See, it's pretty easy to make it up to third story. Once you're good at it, like I said. Then, try the canyons. This is a pretty decent place to practice Lucio. Once you're decent at the previous steps, by the way, Lucio. Kind of go like this with my left hand. Um, once you get decent at it, you can maybe, with either rock monkey, water, any of that stuff, even normal monkey, Maybe go to here and try to Lucio. Let me make sure I'm in a good spot. All right. Then you could try to Lucio. Shoot. Okay. You could try to Lucio right here. It will be very hard. I'm not gonna lie. That's why I kind of suggest Rock Monkey for doing that. Uh, if you want to do verticals, then verticals. If you all run on slips, it's basically kind of a vertical because it takes a same amount of effort, I guess. It's a pretty good spot. Like that. Um, here even. <laughs> it's a lot of practice with one hand. One hand while running. It's a really hard hit downward. You can even go from ground. Or backwards up. I'm not gonna go backwards right now, but you can do ground up like that. I'll try backwards once. Yeah, I messed up. I've done it backwards like that. Oh shoot, my hit messed up. But it's whatever. Once you get it down decently, then you could, if you like, try it over here. Going back to here. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to forest and try to show maybe like straight up right here. Vertical loose seals basically. Try to make it to here. Even if you only make it to here, you can just walk on up. Then you could try going like this. I'm loose sealing all the way to stump. It kind of gets hard right there because the, the wall changes up a little bit. Touching slips and hitting off like that. That's good practice for getting good on like uneven walls and stuff. Like I said about the planks earlier. Could even go from right here and try to vertical up. Oh, I messed up. Try to vertical that branch, even like this. There's even just small two hits, and then you could get like three or four hits and get to here. Or once you're even better at that and you can perfect perfect it, everything I just showed you, you could 
Theoretically. <laughs> Tried that to brand. I, I just messed up, but. Tried that to branch, which is very difficult. Don't get me wrong. Don't, don't give up because you can't do it. Or I keep making it to branch. It's really hard to make it to the top from the ground. But branch is good enough, honestly. Now, <laughs> that's kind of it, to be honest. Yep. It's the most important part, isn't it? A little extra trick, just in the mountains for fun. <laughs> no, not talking about that. It's like a, a vertical combined with angles, I guess. You go right, go creep. Where are you? I'm not waiting for you. Haha, -ha, loser. Anyway. <laughs> okay, I messed up. That's cringe. It's mountains is way better with like 120 hertz. I'm not gonna lie. Or 90. I like playing 90 in mountains. But shut up. <laughs> what the? Anyway, this is what I'm talking about, Black. You suck. Anyway, put an outro here, I guess. Insert funny meme, am I right? Yeah. <laughs>